Today, Sarah and I are going to prepare something that for our family is just an incredible treat. It's gonna be crostini. Crostini con salsiccia, and um, sometimes it's made with stracchino, sometimes it's made with crescenza. Today, we had crescenza, which is a soft cheese available. Let's set these aside. And I'm gonna tell you a bit of uh, tradition in Italy. Whenever you invite somebody over for a meal or you go over to somebody's house, very often before the meal, you serve crostini and they can be made into all kinds of different ways. I think here in the States, you call them um, bruschetta or something like that. We're gonna mix all this up really well together. Stracchino and crescenza nowadays are commercially very similar, although in the past there were very distinct cheeses. But let's mix this all up really well, and then we're going to be able to place it on each slice of bread and slide them in the oven that has been preheating. And boy, is this gonna be a treat. Now that we've sliced all the bread and placed it on here, we're going to get some of this incredible meat and cheese mixture. And generously put it on here. By the way, we made these baguette last week and sometimes when we have too many, we either give them away or even freeze them. So these we took out from the freezer this morning and they're absolutely perfect to do this with. Our crostini are ready to go into the oven and slide them in right here on the side. Let's close the door and allow the oven to do its magic. Let's peek in. Oh yes, it looks amazing. Now we're gonna rotate it and allow it to finish baking. And now we're gonna place them back inside for maybe two or three minutes. Our crostini con salsicce stracchino are coming out and look at these beauties. Let's place these crostini salsicce crescenza on this old olive wood platter. And oh, look at there how appetizing and delicious they look. This is gonna make everybody in the family happy. Let's see, let's place them like this and then maybe just a few little leaves of parsley just to give it some color. And this is gonna be the most inviting antipasto ever. So I'm going to take one and wish you un buon appetito. Mmm, 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 mmm.